Because I think one of the biggest hurdles to getting people involved with local food is knowing how to prepare it in a way that fits with the busy lifestyles that we all lead. So in uh, North Carolina, there are many, many good farmers markets, many more than there used to be. So we really encourage people to make that a part of their week to go into the farmer's market. And, and we encourage people to buy what's fresh uh, and then build your menu around that. Okay, so buy what's fresh, what's seasonal. But then I think many families, what they need to do is they need to organize their Sunday so that they've got some time to cook and, and prepare as much of that food, you know, and go, go buy the grocery store after you go to the farmer's market. You know, do, do a, a lot of cooking on one day when you've got the time so that when you come home and nobody wants to cook, everybody's tired, you've already got it there. The best dishes are often the ones that have the least amount of preparation required. So stir fry, great way to use lots and lots of vegetables. Uh, um, uh, omelets, uh, soup, salads, these are basic techniques that are easy to learn. They're in every cookbook. They're all over the website. Nothing is always perfect. Nothing is, all, is just right. I can always tweak it just a little bit more. But you don't have to. You don't, you don't always have to. You may not be 100% satisfied, but your friend, your family, your neighbors, they may think it's just wonderful. And my advice to any home cook is, is just do what you love. Make what you think is great and I'm sure your friends and family will love it too. Mm -hmm.